Okay, there's two things you need to know about me. I'm an NFL fan. I'm an NBA fan. Let's talk football. I know I just talked about sport or uh, NBA, but let's talk football. I am a Saints fan. Die-hard Saints fan, even though I get laughed at by Raiders fans for being a Saints fan. Even though Raiders are improving with Derek Carr, they still make fun of me because, you know, fuck the Saints, apparently. So, if you don't know, the quarterback is Drew Brees. Too bad I'm not wearing my Not Easy Being Breezy shirt. The quarterback is Drew Brees. I think he's fucking great, but people see him as a piece of shit, not very good. You know, he got hurt. He was never going to throw a pass again with his right arm. And then he's leading the year with uh, yards. And he got the most uh, clutch player of the year. Fucking great. But their defense, the only reason that I see that they're not making it to the playoffs, they can score touchdowns. Second best offense in the league or the sixth best. It's like top five or six. I'm pretty sure it's the second. They can score touchdowns. They can score the points they need to. And here comes the defense. It's ranked 31st in the league. They could score 45 points every motherfucking game. Another team could score 48 points. Because it got to the point where if you played the Saints defense, you were going to score. It came down to the statistics that they fucking suck. So, here comes free agency. You know, everyone's favorite time of year to look and improve their team. If they got they got some cap space room for their team, get some new fucking members. You know, really change their team. First of all, the Saints cap space was not that much, you know, everyone's saying, it's going to improve, we're going to get more cap space, because Drew Brees' contract is expiring at the end of this year, $30 million against cap space, people are saying, let me breathe for a second, people are saying, that was going to get done before free agency, to, you know, get some more money, so the first big contract they made was with Kobe Fleener, Fleener, tight end, from the Colts. And it was like worth $7 million or something like that. And their defense is the problem. I understand why they did that because they lost Benjamin Watson, Ben Watson, to the Ravens, who is a fucking 35 year old boss. It's a fucking boss. So, you know, it's like, okay, that goes by. Just breeze by. And we start working on their the defense. They bring in. James Laurinaitis, a middle linebacker from the Rams. They brought him in because he played. Talking really fast. He played eight seasons with the Rams without getting hurt. So, you you know, that sounds good. Then the white ball dude doesn't get hurt and he knows how to play football. The thing is, he's ranked, he was ranked 83rd. You know, on the middle linebackers. So, he's already played eight seasons of football. He might not be very good anymore. He might not be very good anymore. But they brought him in because of the leadership qualities. They call, they're calling him the quarterback of the Saints defense. And then, uh, who else did they bring in? They brought in Craig Robertson. Uh good linebacker from the Browns, if you get what I'm saying. You know, apparently he's good. He's coming from the Browns. So, they bring him in because he's also supposed to be good. So, I guess that fixes the linebacker situation. Then, just recently, I'm going to kind of skip around in time. Just recently, they brought in Roman Harper, where he played with the Carolina Panthers for two years. After previously playing with the Saints. Carolina Panthers didn't sign him again. Because they thought he was. You know his career was going up. He was reaching that part of his career. The declining part. So they're like. We can just. We're, we're just going to replace him with someone more younger. You know still in their prime. 
New Orleans Saints. Shit, dude, the guy's in free agency. Come on, dude, come on, come back to the team. Let me bring him back to the team. I guess they drafted Von Bell, safety. Now they got Rowan Harper. They got Kenny Vicario, Bird, uh, like J Jarvis Bird or something like that. I can never pronounce his name. The one, kind of off topic, one of my favorite podcasts. Uh, one of my favorite names ever on the Saints, on the Saints team is Michael Human Wananui, tight end, like third string. Anyways, so they draft Sheldon Rankins with the 12th pick in the NFL 2016 draft to kind of stop the rushing, put that dude on on the defensive line, the line up front. So I guess, you know, that's good. They can at least stop some runs. And one of their still biggest problems is watching the quarterback, you know, the defensive end. They got one prime Cameron Jordan who is 99 on the top 100 players of the year so he knows how to play football he's good at it so they had a Huaua Kakiki I'm gonna have to cut him in right there because I don't know actually it's like but during training Dude can't raise my leg that high. He tore an ACL, so then they're screwed again. So then they signed Daryl Tapp. Daryl Tapp. Oh, I almost forgot. So, how I was talking about the defensive line. They also brought in Nick Fairley from also the Rams. With a one-year deal. So, that improves their... I mean... Bringing all these new players, hopefully they just don't suck. You know, I check my phone while I'm doing this, so unprofessional. So hopefully they don't suck to bring in all these new, all these new players, and hopefully let's get that 31st ranked defense to at least 25th. Or, you know, 26. Even the Redskins made it to the playoffs. And their defense was ranked 28. We just need a defense that can stop the ball every other time. Like, you know, if you score, if you score a touchdown, you know, at least stop them. So, you know, we need some more fourth downs. We need some more quarterback sacks. If you get, you know, if you score seven points, and then it's their turn. And they don't score anything. And then you have a great offense. So you could easily score again. You could be up like 14 to nothing. If you know what I'm saying. Just. You know. We just. Just. Get some fourth downs. We need some more sacks. We need some more fourth downs. So we could. You know. Score the points. So we could score points. Without giving up points. I know I've been talking a lot about the Saints. Like I said, hopefully they're, let's, let's hope that they'll be in Super Bowl 51. I can wear my Saints beanie, my Saints bat, hat. I'll even wear my Saints blanket like a cape if they make it to the Super Bowl. And I'll run outside. That's all for now.